hi and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new my name is jessica nicole i am an indie ya romance fantasy author and this is one of my writing vlogs um <laughs> it's been a minute since i vlogged originally i had said i was going to vlog every day then i was like every other day i'm gonna try to hold myself to twice a week so um yeah i'm vlogging this on a friday but i'm gonna upload it probably like sunday so i'm gonna attempt my 24 hour write a thon today um the time has come um originally i was gonna make it a read and write a thon but honestly i'm more in like a writing space right now I am currently reading Lore by Alexander Bracken, and I love that book. Um, I'm really enjoying the story so far. I'm about a little more than halfway through it right now, but I kind of just want to focus on... I'm having a lot of fun writing Moonshot, and so I kind of just want to write Moonshot, and, you know, I don't want to be going back and forth between, uh, you know, constantly trying to do both because when I read I like to kind of be absorbed in what I'm doing and I like to like sit there for a good couple hours with whatever I'm reading um, and then you know with writing I like same thing I like being focused on it so I'm just gonna do a 24 hour write-a-thon and you know just keep reading in my spare time like I've been doing um, challenges to this 24 hour write-a-thon today I am tired <laughs> If you uh, can't tell that already, I am so tired. I stayed up until literally 4 in the morning. It is 8.48 right now, just about. I'm going to start writing at 9. I stayed up till 4 in the morning um, trying <laughs> to get like pa a paperback cover made. I made it myself. Hopefully it gets approved because I <laughs> stayed up for 4 hours doing it. Um, yeah, so I did that, just, yeah, blood, sweat, and tears into that, and it took me so long, but I, once I start something, I don't like to, you know, leave it undone, so yeah, I'm tired, so I'm not physically prepared for this at all, so we're just gonna see. Um, another challenge to this is later on in the day, I'm gonna be, like, co-babysitting with my mom, she's watching my nieces two of my nieces and um they are bad <laughs> they're not bad they're just they're kids they're three and seven and so you know and um they love me so <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna be able to have like too much time there but I'm gonna like make time the beauty of a laptop and an ipad I guess um so what I'm gonna do how I'm gonna do this I'm gonna do 30 minute writing sprints with 15 minute breaks. I also am getting paid today. So I'm getting paid from my teaching job. I'm a I'm a teacher, nine to five. Well, not nine to five, pretty much 24 seven is how that job is. But anyways, I'm getting paid today from that. And so I'm gonna go to the grocery store. Um, So I'm gonna like be writing on my phone in the grocery store, probably my iPad um, in the grocery store. So y'all, I will vlog that. <laughs> And, um, yeah, so I'm going to do 30-minute sprints with, um, 15-minute breaks. Yeah, I think that's about, that's pretty good. 30-minute sprints, 15-minute breaks, and I'm going to do that from 9 a.m. today to 9 a.m. tomorrow is the plan. So, yeah. <laughs> we'll see how, um, sane I am by the end of it. We'll see, you know, hopefully I'm not delirious. But yeah, we're just gonna see. Here we go. And yes, I am still in my pajamas. I literally woke up, brushed my teeth, washed my face, tamed my hair, and yeah, I'm in my polar bear nightgown still. So, so, um, let's get writing. I'm probably gonna break this video up into a couple of different vlogs because I don't want it to get too terribly long, but I want to make sure you guys get a lot of detail two so it's probably gonna be at least two videos maybe three i don't know we'll see all right here we go 
Okay, so I'm starting off at 27,000 words, and I just started chapter 10, like I'm right at the beginning of it. Um, I'm just going to keep track of uh, each hour and the words I write in that hour in here, and yeah, let's just get going because the clock is going to strike nine any second now. So these are the kind of... <laughs> the kinds of things you look up when you are writing a book. I was looking up different window styles, like different types of window shapes. I was trying to describe this basically in chapter 10. It's a window in Laika's bedroom and I'm describing like the view from the window and so I needed to, <laughs> I needed to know how to describe this window. But Basically, I have been writing for about three hours now, so I'm going to go ahead and log my progress. I'm going to try to do that one-handed. It's likely not going to work for me, but we'll try. Alright, so I've count I counted these lines and I'm not gonna have enough space to give every hour its own situation, so I'm gonna combine some. So ten to eleven and we got six hundred words. All right, just checking in. Um, I've been grouping hours together here because I want to have space at the bottom to kind of like write my reflections on how this went for me. Um, but yeah, as you can see, my lowest point probably was this time. That was when I was out. Yeah, it's this time. This one was just a little bit better. I was out running errands. And then here, you know, getting back home, putting things away, settling in. But I have been consistently writing every single hour. So that's the whole point of this. Right now it is 621 and I'm going to keep writing. Um, I've gotten so much done. I've written 2,000 words already today and I'm still feeling good. Um, got a long way to go until uh, 9 a.m. tomorrow, but I'm feeling good. All right. <laughs> so as you can see, I have changed my 24-hour word of right. I can't even talk. My 24-hour write-a-thon goal to a 12-hour write-a-thon goal. Um, yeah. Sometimes I don't think things through before I do them, and or before I decide I'm going to do them. And I did not think this one through, so I think 12 hours is pretty good. If you hear noise, uh, my nieces are here. I'm not going to put them on camera because they are children and um, they cannot consent to being put on camera. So anyways, um, and they're not my children for me to put them on camera or on the internet or whatever anyway. But anyway... Um, yeah, so I started off the day with 27,000 words, and I'm gonna hopefully end the day with 30,000 words. I think that would be awesome. So I'm going to write from, it's about like mm, 7.15 now. I'm gonna write from 7 all the way through 9, so it'll actually be till 10 p.m., but I'm gonna write and try to get 700 words in that time because yeah that'll give me my 30,000 and I am not mad at myself for cutting the time limit in half I'm not gonna be upset with myself about it I'm you know proud of myself for doing it this long and you know you try things you figure out what works for you and staying awake for 24 hours is not gonna work for me so um yeah I have learned really good things through this though. Let me go ahead and re 
and go ahead and recap what I've learned now because I'll just show you my final word count um, at the end of the night. Okay, so I have learned that um, I can write about 300 words in a 30 minute time frame. Good to know. Um, I have learned that I like kind of integrating writing into my life. Um, if I'm somewhere where I can kind of have like peace and quiet, like when I was writing at Walmart, I was so scattered and distracted. I think I maybe got like maybe 50 words written because I just, you know, I like to be at peace. I like to be, you know, kind of in the zone when I'm writing and I can't do that when I'm like surrounded by folks and out and about. So like, I don't think coffee shop writing or anything like that would be for me, which I've never tried it, but I don't think I need to because there was just so much going on and I was like, no, could not focus, could not concentrate. So I learned that useful. Um, I also learned that I really love writing. I knew that already, but I just love writing. Like every time I take a break, sometimes I take breaks and I feel like I don't really need those breaks. Like every time I take a break, I'd be thinking about the story and what I wanted to happen next. Um, when I finish this chapter, I will have gotten through the first 10 chapters of my book. So, um, yeah, super proud of myself, excited and happy to have done this and learn new things about myself and my writing style and what I like when I'm writing, what I don't like when I'm writing. I also have had no coffee today, so I'm doing great. Um, but yeah, I will go ahead and get back to it. I got uh, 700 more words to write to hit my 30,000 word goal for the day and I will, you know, show you guys the screen to prove to you that I um, hit the word count goal and then I'm gonna go ahead and in the video after that so yeah I'm just gonna get to writing now and that is that 30,000 words so that's 3,000 total for the day and tomorrow I'll be starting chapter 11 super proud of myself um super tired <laughs> so this 12 hour writeathon was a success in my book um I hope you guys enjoyed it um don't forget to like this video comment and subscribe and I will catch you in my next one bye